You know what? I think we're gonna bet that they're worth more than the necklaces. Unless it's silver necklaces. There's another emerald. I think I thought Lily had whoops, a few pearls. Oh, it's a water opal. I guess I should apologize. Normally we don't do this, but uh, that was part of the reason to even come here, was to raise a uh, coin, to purchase equipment for the fight with uh, at the Temple of Bull. So we do want to maximize as much as we can. All right. Look at this, we're close to 30,000 coin already. Assuming then this Thy temper shield <laughs> will take us to the stone golem room. Yeah. <laughs> so this uh, routine I think we understand by now. Thy Valkor's mighty blade. kicking for goodness. Just in case uh, they they're gonna change it. All right. Not sure what voice this is, but uh, talking about the great troll killer being their provider and protector. There was no warning, but it would not have helped. We lived as family. So the West is usually the voice, I think, of the doppelgangers or illithid. We came to kill, but not without reasons. The tower intruded on their expansions. This is the craftsman talking. We crafted as we were told. Not really telling us much though, okay. What is your command? So protection from fire. Nature. And electricity. And I think in case there's a new type of punishment, <laughs> maybe blast. Course, 
And here with the, uh, quite a lengthy question. <laughs> this is the end of things. Here I stood and struck them down as they came. My family and my clan, with their false faces, they dropped all pretense and drew their weapons against me. Alright, but he's saying that they were not the real evil. The real evil could not save my people before this deception. The real evil, hid from life in the face of this tragedy, deserves the blame. This is the end of things. Answer where blame has fallen. Upon the invaders? It's one option. Oh. Well, shared among all of them. Everybody but Durlag. Wow. trying to read this uh, more or less swiftly. I guess uh, this fourth option sounds reasonable as far as uh, the invaders. Not to blame because as they said uh, the tower was invading their space I guess so to say. People aren't to blame. And the craftsmen were simply doing their job. So, none are to blame, but there was another option that was very similar to that. Oh, the other one was all to blame, so I think uh, none to blame. Really, it comes down to, I think, <laughs> Durlag's the one to blame. That's probably one of the reasons that maybe he's tormented. Because he realizes it's, it's his own fault. You were the one to blame, so I think this is actually the better choice. Three. Though, uh, <laughs> it takes quite a bit of courage to tell Durlag it's his own fault in his tower. You have understood. Alright, so that was correct. You may yet survive what I could not. For once, uh, I think we answered correctly. Previous two questions we've gotten wrong the first time. Okay. Wow. Well, I think it's been a longer session than usual. I'm probably going to pause it here. I think uh, next time we'll be looking finally then if uh, we're able to open this hidden passageway, hoping then to finally gain access to Soul Taker and I guess Tomb of Durlag himself. We've actually gone through three paths now. And, uh, I think that's all we needed to actually do. Alright, but, uh, if you've been watching, thanks, and, uh, later.